Yo guys, what up? Me, Patrick LeVar. In this video, I'm gonna talk about my three top mobile purchase accessories from 2019. Stay tuned. Yo, welcome back, it's me, Patrick LeVar. If you are new to my channel, I predominantly film with mobile cell phones. I love mobile photography and I shoot a lot with mobile gimbals. So if you're into that, you might wanna hit that like button or subscribe button. Enough of the jibber jabber. Actually, this year was a good year for 2019 for filming with mobile phones. So many gimbals came out, so much te new technology. Uh, the new iPhone 11 has like three lenses on it. It's getting crazy and the future is only gonna get more intense. But 2019, for me personally, I'm gonna tell you about the three things that I purchased that really helped me a lot on, in my filmmaking journey, uh, journey this year. And the first one was going to be Filmic Pro. Filmic Pro, that's all I can say. If you are serious about filming on a cell phone or a mobile phone, you need Filmic Pro. Pro. There are two levels of film. There's a basic Filmic Pro and then there's the color grade, color grade package, whatever. I don't know, whatever. When As soon as it came out, I just bought it. I didn't care because I was so dedicated to the standard Filmic Pro. When you buy the color package, you get uh, a couple of uh, flat profiles. So if you're into color grading and taking your videos up to another level, you want to purchase that, you know, because uh, on the big cameras, all the big cameras can do these log formats and that really helps to go and do color grading. So I would definitely, you want to check out that, that whole package, it's worth the money. You have complete manual control of your camera, of your phone, like you do with a big, uh, a big camera. So that would be the first thing I would look into. Second for me was storage. Now that I'm the last couple of months here, I'm starting to film a little bit in a higher frame, uh, not higher frame, but I'm starting to film at 2K and above now because I want to get the most, uh, the most data in my image and shooting at a higher quality, a 2K, a 4K, a 3K, something like that is going to capture more data and a higher bit rate. So right now it, on my Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge, that's what I use. And I just, it's my daily phone. So like I do have a couple of games on there and stuff. I probably have anywhere from two to three free gigs. Now recording at 2K, 3K or 4K, seriously, that could be about 40 seconds or less than a minute worth of recording time. And then my phone will be full. That's where this came in. A sound, I'm using, this is the Samsung Galaxy 250 gigs um, SSD T5 here. This really helped me to be able to take, again, just to be able to film at a higher quality and when my phone was full, I'll just, boom, pull all the data, put it onto this and continue to film. A lot of my other videos where I go out to Kyoto and I go out to all these other places and you know, I'm shooting at least 15, 20 minutes worth of footage at 2K resolution and it's all because of this. If I didn't have this, I mean, like you, I would have to bring my laptop around and then like, okay, shoot a video, my phone is full, pull it off, put it on my laptop. This allows me to plug it into my phone straight from Filmic Pro. I select my fit, my, uh, my clips, boom, drag them onto this, boom, unplug it, and then I'm back to going recording. This was a game changer right here. And lastly, for me, for me, again, this is my opinion, guys, it's not a gimbal. It's actually this little lens right here, the Ulanzi Anamorphic Lens. Now the last two months, again, um, if you guys follow my channel, you know I've been starting to get into the anim. This is something that I've wanted for a long time. Moment had, there's way before this came out, but with Moment, you have to have like almost the newest type of phone because all their cases were for newer phones. I have a Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge, they didn't make a case for. They made it for a case for the Samsung 8 and above and all these new phones. And then all these new phones have multiple lenses and I'm just like, you know what? I was so sad. All right, prime example. I'm filming at 2K right now and right in the middle of that, it, it was full. I'm gonna slap this bad boy in there, pull off this footage and get right back to recording. This is how we do it, mobile filmmaking, baby. <laughs> okay, enough with the rant. You guys saw the whole hard drive thing. Anyways, Filmic, I mean Filmic Pro, Filmic Pro, Samsung Galaxy hard drive, and the Ulanzi anamorphic lens are my Patrick LeVar mobile filmmaking guy. <laughs> my top three, I would say 
not not, not for the decade but for 2019 and then we got all the gimbals but that gimbal is a gimbal but those are my top three things from 2019 if you guys like what you see here you're in the mobile filmmaking smash the like button share the video to somebody who might like it also, I just jumped on the new Firework app. Uh, I have a profile over there. I'm getting into making these quick 30 second little lessons, quick in, quick out. If you're into something like that, you might wanna jump onto that. I'll have the link down in the description. Link will be down in the description for all this stuff down there. All that jibba jabba. Patrick LeVar, keep filming. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. See ya. And quickly, just wanted to show you guys what I shot this all on. I'm using this light here. It is that company light. <laughs> um, I got my Rogue microphone here, my uh, Tribion Cinemount, very old. They don't even make it anymore. And I've got my phone connected. I didn't use Filmic Pro for this video. I just used my standard, uh, my standard Samsung app right now. And then I have this all mounted onto this tripod. It's my little quick YouTube Go setup. I can, when I get an idea, all I do is just put this on there, plug in the light, and I go and I'm ready to record. Super quick and easy and efficient. Patrick LeVar, this is how we do it. Peace. See ya.